If you ever wonder why so many moralistic people, whether it's a pompous politician or a loudmouth preacher, people who get up behind on a stage and talk about who's good and who's evil, so many of those folks get caught up in moral scandals. This is at least part of the answer. It's because they think their moral harshness is a shield against sin, but in reality, it's just producing more pride in them that makes their fall that much worse. Romans 7, Paul talks about it. He says, listen, the man I was before, the law actually led me into sin. When all I had was the law, the law just reminded me that there was such a thing as coveting. So what did I do? I coveted. He's not saying it's the law is a bad thing. He's saying that just shows how evil I am, that the law of God can produce sin in me. But thanks be to God, because there's a Savior named Jesus Christ. And so in Philippians 3, kind of the second half of that autobiography of Paul, he says, when I lost all that dependence on the law, all that pride that I had in being more righteous than my brothers, when all I had left was Jesus, that's when I had freedom. That's when I found the life that I was called to live.